you can start earning three hundred dollars or more every single month as a beginner on the online space and what exactly do you need to start doing you need to start offering services online and in this video today i'm diving into being a freelance social media manager now as a freelance social media manager you get to manage the social media accounts of your clients their businesses of brands of company whichever right you will be managing their social media accounts now as a social media manager there are several things that you can do you can help them create content you can help them strategize on you know types of content that they should be posting you can help them with their content calendar you can help them with improving their engagement you can equally help them with running ads i mean highly converting ads which will help them grow which will help their business grow right now as a social media manager i focus more on the aspect of targeting the right audience for their ads helping them with their ad setup and even running the ads for them that's the aspect of social media managing that i specialize in okay now and that's what i will be focusing more before you can start managing social media accounts for your clients you need to understand these social medias like you need to understand these social media platforms we have facebook we have instagram we have tiktok we have linkedin there are loads of them there are a number of them right now you need to understand how these social medias work you can agree with me that the way twitter works is quite different from the way instagram works the way linkedin is is different from the way facebook is so you need to understand how this different social media um platform works so that you'll be able to offer the best service to your clients personally i focus more on facebook and instagram the clients i'm working with i'm in charge of their ad setup and everything when it comes to facebook and instagram that's where my strength is those are the platforms i understand the most so i focus my attention there why am i pointing this out for you to become a social media a manager you don't need to be doing all of the social media platform at the same time just grab one master the way it works and you know you can offer services based on that particular one you are good at don't say oh, i can manage your twitter account i can manage your instagram i can do linkedin see you might end up being a jack of all trade master of none how about you master one first even when it comes to mastering one there are different aspects you can master just as i said earlier i focus more on ad setup audience targeting running ads you can equally you know focus on their content calendar helping them with engagement helping them you know as a customer service now you also need to understand that as a freelance social media manager you don't have to be present in your employees company or you don't need to be physical there for you to carry out your job it is a remote job that you can do from anywhere at all in the world and trust me this particular side also is making you millionaire these days you can be in nigeria and you're working for a company in the u.s I am in Lagos. I have clients in Abuja. I have clients in Port Harcourt that are managing their social media accounts for them. I don't necessarily need to be present there. It is something I can do right from the comfort of my home with my laptop or my smartphone. Do you understand? Now, I don't know the aspects you want to focus on, but because I understand Instagram I want to show you guys practically some of the things I handle for my clients when it comes to managing their Instagram pages or their Instagram business accounts I want to show you some of the things I some of the things I handle I might be using my account I don't want to you know show their account I will just show you how I set up their ads how I help them to you know target the right audience for their business and all those so you have an idea if this is something you want to go into you let me know in the comment section you know highlighting the specific areas you want to cover i might start creating videos on those so that you have knowledge and start offering these other service and start making money for yourself so i'm just going to take it down my phone screen and show you how i cover um the aspect of social media managing that i'm working at right now so let's go into it guys i'm sorry i'm going to be using my business account for this i cannot use that of my clients because i don't have the permission to you know use it even if i start blurring their names 
um there are other contents which i don't think they would want me to show right so i'll be using my own freely here this is my page at onis collection you already know what we do here so when i come to my clients page their business page first thing i do is to take a look at their bio is it syncing with the type of product they sell or the service they offer i mean is their bio well optimized you guys understand bio right this right up your scene at the top i try to make sure that i go ahead and optimize their bio properly if it's not well organized right that's the first thing i do even if that's not part of my job most of the time but i make sure i go into i get their login details as in social media manager they trust you right because they have seen your portfolio you've been doing it before so they trust you they give you their login details you get to log into their account from your own end do you understand or they will add you from their own end as a manager right and so once i get into the account this way i go ahead and optimize their bio as you can see from my bio here since this page is all about bags and shoes you can see from the top it says your one-stop store for ladies handbags and shoes in lagos are you seeing it let me show you guys how important it is for you to optimize your bio just type ladies handbags in lagos and you can see my page there as the number two account on his collection that's because that account is well optimized so that if anybody is searching for ladies handbags in lagos of course they will see my account and chance might just bring them to my page and they buy from me so it is important for you to optimize your account your username your bio everything should be on point now once you're done make sure you add a call to action to your bio you can see my call to action there i said click on the link below so once they click on the link it will take them to this my mini um should i call it a mini website that says welcome to Onis collection blah 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 so from here they can click to join our whatsapp group they can click to join our telegram channel they can order these are our two order lines can you see it? so this page is well optimized to receive customers before you start running ad or before i start running ad for my clients i do well to check their page make sure it is well optimized to receive what to receive customers now another thing you need to understand as a business owner on instagram is that people don't have time to start scrolling down down your page they don't have that patient they don't have that time now this first six to nine posts on your page is very important let me let me let me underline it so you understand people don't trust you easily of course not their fault you need to make sure that this post one post two post three post four post five and post six or seven eight nine convinces them to buy from you asap because they don't have time to start scrolling to see if you're legit or not that is why i tell people whenever you want to post on instagram make sure that you're posting with a strategy this is something i do for my clients right i tell them post with strategy of i post my products you create a content that shows your face if you want to show your face then there should be a review attached to it now you can see my pink post that's why pink posts are important you can see my pink post this pink post i just pinned this one today these are wholesale deal for those that want to sell sneakers so when they see this they know we sell sneakers here now these are orders that are going out customers order trying to convince them that yes we send out orders on a daily basis these are not audio these are real-time customers orders they can see the names they can see everything right and then with this one that tells them i sell handbags do you understand your pin post should be something that when they click it should tell them exactly what your business is all about sometimes i encourage people to go ahead and add what this stuff you're seeing here like if they click on kiddies they'll see some of the kiddies stuff we have if they click do you understand you can add this as well they can see reviews you can see real time reviews from our customers can you see our customers that are buying for more steady you can see their review so make sure your page is optimized now to the business of the day what i do for my clients after advising them to set all these well or i do it myself and once we are done with making sure that everything 
you know on the page is looking pink everything is looking okay we go into the business of the day which is to run ads and drive more traffic to this page in order to make more sales right now there are different types of contents that you can use to run ad you can use a product content like this to run ads or you can use a content where you are sharing value based on the product or the service you sell so let me use this as an example you can see that here on this page i sell mostly bags and sneakers right and i want to run ad you don't run ad with random content you run ad with intentional content now check out this particular content here check out this one you can see it is currently boosted i'm running ads with it because on this content i have a call to action on this content i know the mission like i know the aim of running this content i want people to know we sell shoes here so you can see what i'm doing with this content there are premium kiddie sneakers see do not snooze on this that is a mom is in the house this is the time for you to you know give your now with this content i imprinted different pictures of the quality sneakers we sell just to tell them that yes we have variety there is a call to action at the top when you click on the caption there is also a call to action and whenever you want to run ads for yourself or your clients make sure you're running ad with a strategy like the strategy here is that i combine different types of sneakers in this particular video showing them that we have varieties of sneakers then you can go ahead and you know add your call to action i have my call to action on top telling them to use the link in bio to join our telegram channel down here you can see what i have down here right then you can go ahead and start running ad let's say i want to run ad with this particular post i can decide to run it here on instagram by clicking on the boost post or you can use your ads manager on your phone or your pc whichever one see whichever one you use the main thing is for you to target well use the right amount your ad is going to convert do you understand so here it's asking what do you want people to do when they see your ad most of the times i make use of profile visits because with profile visits we get to a notice that we get more followers we also make sales with profile visit and it is cheaper if you don't know that know it now you guys should have noticed that currently if you want to run ad or more you're spending a lot so you need to make sure that you're going with the objectives that is giving you results so i make use of um visit profile then i click next right now you can see i have different audience set up here based on the type of ad i want to run if you don't know how to set up your audience targeting please learn it it will help your business okay it will help your business so i will just choose anyone just choose anyone and click on next now you can see that hey <laughs> this is funny running ads currently is expensive i must be honest with you all you can see now they're already giving me a daily budget of eight thousand three hundred this is quite high i remember those days when we could run ad with a thousand naira, and you'll be seeing mad conversion so i'm gonna reduce this most of my customers they prefer using this 4984 my clients they prefer using this budget and they are seeing results with this budget so don't just run ad with a budget that you know you cannot maintain if you know you want to go down to 3323 three, please go down to it based on your business based on your capacity some people can run out of you know up to 10k daily they can afford it their business can afford it do what your business can afford so i'll go with this four nine which is approximately five thousand era you want to set duration you set duration i don't usually set duration because you don't want the ad to just stop when it's already picking up your same result already and the ad will just stop so i don't set duration if i want to turn off the ad i just go straight to my ads manager and turn off the ads from there do you understand so when you're done you click on next you need to top up your ad account you go ahead and top up your ad account right once you're done you click on boost post and after some review your ad will start running this is mostly what i do for my clients i help them set up their target audience right that's my place of speciality i help them 
set up their target audience and you know help them with a the type of content to use that will give them maximum results so hope you've learned one or two from this video guys you've seen it all for yourself it is not difficult at all it's something i just sit in front of my laptop and i do for my clients and they pay me by the end of the month i just need to submit um my worksheet i just need to submit my monthly report they go through it see how far we've gone see the progress we've made they pay me my money and that's it and you can start aiming for yourself like as a beginner this is something you can start doing and you can start making money for yourself if you've gotten any value right from this video please give it a thumbs up leave comments in the comment section let me know which aspect of social media managing do you want to go into is this something you would love to you know learn more about let me know in the comment section and trust that i'll try to create more content on this so you all can be empowered and start doing something for yourself i love you all